Trump is helping huge corporations and their CEOs get richer, while family farmers struggle to put food on the table. In May, the Justice Department approved a $63 billion merger between pharma ag giant Bayer and chemical seed giant Monsanto. The CEO of Bayer, Werner Baumann, rakes in $6.6 million annually, making him the 10th highest paid pharma CEO in the world. In 2017, Monsanto CEO Hugh Grant received a 64% salary increase, bumping his annual pay to $19.5 million. Grant will retire with a golden parachute worth $32.6 million. To put that in perspective, the average farmer would have to work for more than 470 years in order to make what Hugh Grant is receiving solely as his retirement bonus. Meanwhile, small and mid-sized farmers are continuing to get squeezed by high seed prices. In the past 20 years, corporations have tripled the cost of seeds, pushing many farmers into debt. We can expect seed prices to continue to rise. After the merger, Bayer Monsanto will control 25% of the world market for seeds and pesticides, making it the largest agribusiness corporation in the world. In fact, estimates show that $1 in every $3 a farmer spends on seeds and pesticides will go directly to Bayer Monsanto, ensuring that Warner Bauman can continue to make millions while farmers struggle to feed their families. By approving this merger, the Justice Department is showing that it stands with corporations, not family farmers. Arms.